Airbus presents new Wingman Stealth Drone concept at ILA Berlin. The ILA Berlin Aerospace Show saw the formal unveiling of Airbus Sleek, stealthy Wingman uncrewed concept aircraft, which resembles a fighter jet. Following its reveal earlier this week, additional details about the program have emerged. According to Airbus leadership, the Wingman is expected to have a unit cost that is only one-third that of a modern crewed fighter. The concept aircraft, measuring 39 feet wide and 51 feet long, has been officially presented to the public and German Chancellor Olaf Scholz, who closely examined the full-scale model at ILA Berlin. Simultaneously, Airbus CEO Michael Schollhorn shared his vision for the program. Previously, Schollhorn mentioned that the Luftwaffe, the German Air Force, had expressed a clear need for a drone capable of operating alongside crewed fighters ahead of the Pan-European Future Combat Air System FCS, entering service. The FCS program, featuring the crewed new generation fighters NGF, as its centerpiece, is slated for service entry in the 2040s. This underscores the notion that the Wingman is designed to fulfill the Luftwaffe's need for an uncrewed companion to operate alongside its upcoming Eurofighter EK electronic warfare jets. Schollhorn indicated that the Wingman is anticipated to enter service in the 2030s. In addition to operating with the specialized Eurofighter EK, the Wingman is also expected to work with the Luftwaffe's other Eurofighters which perform a variety of air defense and air-to-ground missions, as well as the F-35A stealth jets that are currently on order. Despite the demanding nature of its role, the Eurofighter EK, like the rest of the Luftwaffe's combat-coded Eurofighters, will be operated by a single pilot. Introducing the Wingman as a companion drone will consequently add to the pilot's responsibilities. Nonetheless, the human pilot in the command aircraft will retain full control over the wingman at all times. To address this challenge, Schollhorn mentioned that the company aims to leverage artificial intelligence AI, to simplify controlling the drone and managing its data. To advance these man-on-man -man teaming technologies for the wingman, Airbus has signed a framework cooperation agreement with Helsing, a defense AI and software company. While we will always have a human in the loop, we must recognize that the most dangerous parts of an unmanned mission will require a high degree of autonomy and thus rely on AI," said Gunbert Scherf, co-CEO of Helsing. From processing sensor data to optimizing subsystems and closing the loop on a system level, software-defined capabilities and AI will be critical components of the wingman system for the German Air Force," Scherf added. Schollhorn confirmed that the current plans include powering the wingman with the same Eurojet EJ-200 turbofan used in the Eurofighter, ensuring a proven power plant and useful commonality. Presently, the concept aircraft features a diamond-shaped exhaust aperture, and it's unclear how this would integrate with the EJ-200's conventional nozzle. A closer examination of the concept aircraft revealed it features a pair of internal weapons bays, enhancing its low observable design. While the specific types and quantities of stores it will carry are still unknown, it is evident that the wingman will be equipped for both lethal and non-lethal effects, including electronic warfare. Additionally, it will be fitted with sensors to support intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance ISR, missions, as well as targeting. Although the showcased concept aircraft adopts a tailless configuration, it's worth mentioning that certain scale models and conceptual illustrations of the wingman also depict it with outward canted tail fins. When asked about this variation, Schollhorn reaffirmed that the design is continually evolving. He emphasized its modular nature, hinting that even in its final iteration, there might be opportunities to adjust the configuration, potentially incorporating flight control surfaces. Schollhorn clarified that the wingman will be modular to a certain extent as we are still in the early stages of the project, and whether we'll introduce specialization later remains uncertain. 
Additional options currently under consideration involve incorporating pylons for external weapon carriage. Computer-generated imagery depicts the drone equipped with Paveway Series precision-guided bombs and brimstone air-to-ground missiles. This enhancement would provide valuable supplementary payload capacity for missions where stealth attributes are deemed non-essential for mission success. Michael Schollhorn emphasized that the wingman will be priced to reflect its exquisite quality yet remain competitive. He stated that it should be approximately one-third of the cost of a crewed fighter. This pricing strategy positions the drone as not easily dispensable, yet still within an affordable range that enhances combat effectiveness. Remarkably, this cost aligns closely with the target set by the USAF for its Collaborative Combat Aircraft CCA, initiative. The Wingman incorporates insights from Airbus' two-decade-long history in military aerospace design. This underscores its reliance on previous innovations, particularly from the Airbus Low Observable UAV Testbed LOUT program. LOUT, a stealthy demonstrator, was developed under tight confidentiality by the company and was unveiled to the public in 2019 despite not being flown. Currently, Airbus is the primary investor in the Wingman project having made a significant double-digit investment to date. However, Schollhorn remains optimistic about the potential for the Luftwaffe to express interest in a drone of this caliber and eventually secure a contract. Reflecting on the current conflicts along Europe's borders, he emphasized the critical importance of air superiority. Over the years, German defense spending witnessed a reduction in military size and capabilities including within the Luftwaffe. With a renewed focus on defense in Germany, Airbus Wingman could find itself strategically positioned to benefit from this evolving security landscape. In the interim, Airbus intends to continue refining the Wingman, anticipating further design modifications before potential orders are finalized.